In this video, I'm going to show you how to make one of my favorite Filipino dishes, and that's pork humbak. What's good, everyone? If this is the first time we're meeting, my name is Rapunzel Angeli Malales, a grade 12 home economics student from Isabel National Comprehensive School. So, growing up, my mom made amazing Filipino foods, and one of my all-time favorite dishes, though, has always been my mom's pork humba. Humba is a Filipino braised pork dish that is very popular in the Visayan and Southern regions. Like any others, there are different manners of cooking this dish. Some people would marinate the meat first for searing, others would skip the searing part entirely. So, let's not beat around the bush and cook with me. Alright, first thing to do is mix and plus. We must prepare all the needed ingredients, tools, utensils, and equipment. I have here 3 4 kilo of the ampo, 1 4 teaspoon of salt, 1 4 teaspoon of ground black pepper, 1 piece of white onion, then we need to mince it. 3 cloves of garlic. Three-fourth cup of pineapple juice. One-fourth cup of soy sauce. One-fourth cup of light brown sugar. One-fourth cup of vinegar. Two pieces of dry bay leaves. One-eighth cup of salted black beans. And lastly, one cup of water. Pair dry 3 or kilo of pork mempo, slice into large cubes on thin layer of oil on medium flame setting. Continue to pair dry on medium flame setting until fat is rendered and meat becomes fully done in color. And wait for 10 minutes. Saute one piece chopped onion on rendered fat on high flame for about 20 seconds. Add 3 cloves of garlic and continue to saute for about 10 seconds. Add to pan dried pork and continue to saute on high flame settings for another 1 minute. Add 3 4 cup of unsweetened pineapple juice. Next is one more cup of soy sauce. Two pieces of baked beef, fried baked beef, and a pinch of ground black pepper. Mix thoroughly and set the flame into medium setting. Add one cup of water. The cooking method that is being applied in this dish is braising. Braising is commonly used with cheaper and tougher cuts of meats because it softens and tenderizes the muscle fibers. After 5 minutes, set the plate to low until meat is soft and tender. Add water if needed. At this point, the meat is already soft and tender. Add 1 8 cup of salted black beans. Our pork kumba is ready to be served. This pork kumba recipe is great for lunch, dinner, and special occasions such as parties, town fiestas, and even holidays. Give this pork kumba recipe a try and share. Once again, this is Rapunzel Angeli Morales, your future chef. Bon appetit!